in one turn. This guy has become almost fully maxed out. Hmm, we didn't find that guy. Didn't get our groundhog. Skilled teapots, maybe. Very similar teams. Mine is just worse. Good, good. <laughs> Do this, this. We did find the groundhog. That's perfect. Hold on to the tamarind level. This should do better, I would think. So you got too many tamarinds out there. You can't possibly do enough. You don't have enough trumpets for them. Alright, level you. Early anteater is a must. Grab you, roll me. Sell. Fantastic. Hold on to you. See what we can do with this ant here. Okay, that should be fine. Yes, it is. Not a huge fan of the sheep this weekly, I'll be honest. Um, we need a good back unit though. We can't just switch out the drop bear for the rat. Those are horrible. Maybe just run it like this. You know, get a big homie up front. Just got to get through the early game with as little damage as possible. That's my, my objective. So far it's going well. Okay, let's get rid of you. Get a little lasagna in the oven. Not interested. Not interested. Maybe the frost wolf. Hold on to him. Yeah, let's do that. It seems okay. <laughs> Right when I switched to the Frost Wolf. Fantastic. Could not have been better timing. I'm tempted to, you know, to eat you just for gold efficiency's sake. Maybe hold on to the frost, or the puppy, <laughs> the frost puppy. You know the kind. Good snipes. Ooh, the dirty rat got us. This is why we need a chupacabra out here. Armadillo and moose. Anything good there? Depends what you consider good, I guess. Maybe we do this. I'm honestly fine ditching both of you here. We don't need to yet, though. I'm gonna see what this moose can do. We haven't really tried the moose yet. I haven't really given him the opportunity to, to thrive. Okay, good hit. I think that's perfect. Yeah, perfect kill with the with the ink old mouse not today thank you but no thank you need some canned food cooking and then we go <laughs> I don't know what we go Put a little on you I guess we'll keep the anteater right probably Maybe we shouldn't be freezing for the moose. We don't really have a very good team yet. Okay, we're still getting there, kinda. Way too late for a wasp. Cockatoo, maybe?
the thing. I just like, I don't like our team very much. So it's hard to commit when you just want to get rid of them all. Okay, start freezing. Blowfish is good. I think we can commit to a blowfish here. Like another moose too. Just if anyone's wondering. If the devs want to help me out a little bit here. Moose would be nice. Is this enough to get us there? <laughs> oh, it is. We get the draw. Okay. Probably worth giving you a, a pineapple. But we're, we're doing okay for ourselves. So there's the moose level we were looking for. Definitely saber tooth angle, I would think. Maybe we ditch you, go here. Level you. I don't really care about you guys. That was mean. I care about you guys, of course. <laughs> it is not very much. Okay. Let's see how this does. I'd love to keep the husky, but the moose would unfreeze it. I think it's safe to say at this point, we've got the health situation covered. Now it's more of a figure out the rest of the team situation. Okay, freeze you guys. Freeze you. Um, maybe mushroom on you. Start getting some Peach of Immortality scaling going. Okay, can't freeze the chocolate, unfortunately, nor the alpaca. It always seems to happen with the moose. You get the chocolate right right after you, you pass three gold, so it doesn't actually do anything. Just a cruel twist of fate, I guess. That guy's huge, what the heck? You guys absolutely- this team would be incredible if we had one good high attack unit. But we don't. <laughs> Here we go, Scorp. Scorp's pretty good. And of course, we gotta get the alpaca scaling on the Scorp, right? Invest in the future. That's the plan. Mm. We gotta ditch this alpaca at some point. Maybe we just do this. Get the extra Peach of Immortality buff. Okay, how's this gonna pan out? Actually quite alright, somehow. We'll take it. I mean, now it's starting to pay in dividends. Um, moose me? Or do we go another Scorp? I feel like that's putting too many... Too many items in our Scorp basket. I like it. Alright. Okay, the mooses are mostly just buffing each other. Which I don't love, but... We hit. Jeez Louise, there's a lot going on around here. <laughs> a whole lot of snipes. But it works out with the saber tooth. So much so that I think we invest in the saber tooth here. That's fantastic. I'll just cornucopia, see what we get. Mushroom or chicken leg? Mushroom doesn't help anybody. Like a little bit the anteater, I guess, but who cares? Let's give you a little love. We'll eventually get the scorpion maxed up here. Get him above 20 attack. Okay. Oh. 
You hate to see it. We were so close. Get the scorpion cooking a little more and we're golden. Yeah, maybe we even do this. We throw a grizzly in there. That's the question. Honestly, probably, yeah. Want it like this? We've got no shortage of health out here. <laughs> Hot dog's actually pretty good. Considering that no shortage of health thing. How did you get peanuts? What the hell? And of course the bear misses. There's so many peanuts. You hate to see it. That's insane. Does the leveled up good dog make him better? Does it give more peanuts? Because that was like the best possible food you could possibly gotten. Well, that aside. Anteater was kind of just there. I think if we swapped Anteater for something better, maybe another Sabertooth? Could have been pretty solid actually. I'm still not sure if it's a 50-50 if the Basilisk goes before the Mosquito. I think it is. I'm pretty sure it is, but it's very hard to tell. And I honestly haven't been paying close enough attention to really say for sure. Ooh, that team hurts. <laughs> that's, that's the perfect counter to my team. Let's run it like this. We got a hybrid here, and hybrid usually doesn't go well, but maybe it will. Like that time we went before there, Mosquito. It's gotta just be a coin flip or something, I would think. Alright, combine you. Give me a roll. Chupacabra, huh? We've been there, we've tried that a few times. Typically doesn't go very well. We got the rat there to support. Maybe this time is different. <laughs> Famous last words. Okay, we get a level next turn. Ooh, gotta have you here. You two come as a package. You know in school whenever you were like, with your friend and you wanted to be on the same team in gym? Like, we come as a package deal. Most of the time it happened when one of them was like actually good at sports and the other one was like... <laughs> Not, um, but you know. Okay, we go here. We go here. Oven mitts. Throw me. Straight up, why don't we just do this? Is that. If we're talking like actual chupacabra in real life, is that an accurate sound that he's making? These are the important things we need to know. Oh, dude, we're cooking here. Hold on. I'm, I'm tempted to old mouse here, but I don't want to override the oven mitts. So I'm going to refrain for a second. Besides, old mouse really... Without the Flying Squirrel, Old Mouse is primarily used with this homie right here, the Mosasaurus. And we can't get him for a little while. Let's just say no for now. I'm not going to override the oven mitts, don't worry. I'm not going crazy out here. Kind of. We get a level 2 oven mitts next turn. Okay. Get a good mosquito hit there. I like how we're investing all this health into a four attack mosquito. <laughs> what the heck is that all about? Okay. Level you. Oven mitts. See, we should invest it in a blowfish. There we go. And let's say we're not doing husky. Let me say that for sure. Yeah. Now we can. <laughs> now we're not doing husky. Okay, that looks good. Do a little bit of damage here. 
Yeah, dude, we're cooking. Wonk and them. See, they only have a level one oven mitt. I think that's the reason. That's why they're bad. Can I get a, another rat? Another rat out here? Ooh, who's better? <laughs> who's better? Probably Blowfish, right? I said it. We're committing. We're not doing Husky. I want to see how far this Blowfish can take us. So far the teams have been pretty lackluster, I would argue. Eight damage every time he, t he gets hit. It's crazy. Level? Turn too late there, mister. Alright, so now we have to ask ourselves. We going for another another puppy out here? If I find one, I'll do it. I didn't find one. Roll me. Not finding much of anything. I don't like... Okay, I think that's my issue with this weekly. I don't like 70% of the pets. <laughs> I'm being completely genuine right now, okay? They're just not good. Hold on. Random perks and ailments. I'm pretty sure he got all perks and I got all ailments. Just throwing it out there. <laughs> if anyone can verify. Um, that didn't feel very even. Let's get a moose out here. When RNG doesn't go your favor, grab a moose. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, we have too many combos. I don't want to get rid of these. This is too good. Hmm. Huh. About that one. Wait. Okay, we draw. That's fine. We'll take it. Oh wait, he had a dirty rat. Hold on. We don't draw, we win. Alright. I, was, I thought I had another blowfish somewhere. He's just hiding. Okay, we go here, grab some more oven mitts. Throw in a cockatoo, I guess. Okay. It is becoming painfully apparent that we desperately need some sort of mass scaling on our team. Okay, hold on. Let's let's take inventory. Ailment, perk, ailment, perk, perk, ailment, ailment. Eh, whatever. It's close. <laughs> it's close enough, I guess. I hate that trigger. So many times. Okay, go here. Get some lasagna cooking. There we go. Hold on. I think we do it like this. Alright, three tier ones I feel like is fair. I think that's a fair number. Can't be too upset with that. <laughs> Agree to disagree. All right, so you're gone. We're we're pretty much done with toys at this point. Um, these two aren't doing much of anything anymore, unfortunately. Maybe go grizzly. Alright, well, apparently this is our new plan. Our new plan of attack. We're gonna try to get triggers just straight off of these little homies from our blowfish. Just 
Jesus. This is a violent match we got here. Everyone's throwing back and forth all over the place. Grizzly, sure. Um, yeah. <laughs> Hold on to the tier ones. We can get another moose or a bear. We'll be very happy. I'm not very happy. Ponpeto, interesting. Considering how ineffective um, held foods typically are, I don't think this is going to do much. But, you know, we'll see, I guess. That's about what I expected. It did survive, which is surprising. But aside from that, pretty pretty much expected. Open for a grizzly, I'll be honest. Um, I think you're gone. Pivot to the saber tooth here. I wanted to freeze that one, but okay. <laughs> Never mind. 24 health in one turn. That's pretty solid. Okay. We need to start getting some, some good pets now. We've been joking around up till now, but it's about time we start Pulling our weight a little bit. Come on. Tier 1s. Zero tier 1s. What the heck is that? Is it time to ditch the rat? I think the answer might be yes. Oh, this blowfish is doing work. Okay. <laughs> okay. I don't know if that was luck or what, but we got there. Hold on to you. There it is, finally. Alright, now we're getting somewhere. I don't think we care about a moose. So we could donut. Get the saber tooth cooking up. Honestly though, I think we just try to get some more level ones. Tier one, sorry. Dude, I get tiers and levels mixed up all the friggin' time. So easy to mix them up. Okay, we get one trigger here. Make it count. That's honestly not bad. Okay. Oh, baby, we're on to something. Oh, baby. Do we win? We win! That's great! <laughs> There's just stuff flying everywhere. I don't know what's going on. But we made it. Okay, so we go here. Look for some more tier ones. And then if we get a saber tooth, you know, that'd be a good power spike for, you know, if we don't win or whatever. Okay, how's this doing for us? That husky, how did that husky get so big? Who's buffing him? Keep rolling. See what we can find. Gotta get a saber tooth out here, if possible. <laughs> we did not find a saber tooth. This could be an issue. I guess we just go, right? Nothing we can freeze, nothing we can buy. We'll send it, see what happens. Oh boy. They are level 1 and 2 though. So that might be our one saving grace. Okay. That just killed us. That phoenix just ruined it. 
That's so sad. I don't know if we would have had it, but man, Phoenix is very strong. This just kind of puts together exactly how this weekly is feeling so far. It's just like a hodgepodge, you know? Unless you get a select few, like this Phoenix kind of vibe. It just feels like a bunch of hodgepodge pets put together. Maybe I'm bad at this. This feels like a good team, which probably means we're going to lose. <laughs> um, yes, that is what that means. We're back at five. Let's level an early wasp. Sure, sure. Don't mind if I do. With a basilisk, it pairs well with a wasp. Hmm. Ants, completely useless there. Could not have been less useless. Not have been less useful, is what I meant. <laughs> Could have been less useless for sure. Uh, we run a tamarin out here. Maybe. Ditch the opossum. Okay. Let's try this. Mmm, that's right. If he's in the back, he's not going to use the groundhog. Whoops. Okay, ditch you. Get a manatee cooking. On who though? <laughs> Who's even good? Um, flea maybe. We do like this. And then straight up just run like that. I think this is fun. Not great, but it's fun. This will pair well into like a moose or something later. Moose or maybe armadillo. Oh, perfect lethal on his part. You hate to see it. Okay. Now, I think Basilisk has got to go. Go here. I don't love the anteater. I don't really want to invest too much. He's like, he feels good early and then just kind of, eh, he's all right. We're getting draws. That's all we're looking for right now. Hey, okay, ditch you. Go here, here, roll me. These are all terrible. Okay. What if we buy sell? And then we can throw in a manatee. Feeling like a get rid of the dodo kind of angle. <laughs> more and more every day. Yeah, Dodo ain't doing jack. That kind of blows. Okay. Well, there's the moose we've been talking about. What if we get rid of you? Run a moose. Don't need to freeze. We're still drawing. Still have yet to get a single win. We're playing the long game. That's what I'm telling myself. Can we get a... What is it? A donut? 
donut would be huge. We cannot get a donut. Donut is not huge anymore. Just like any health on the wasp would be nice. <laughs> that would be much appreciated. Okay, that's good. Alright. We're on the board. Turn 10. One win. That's what we like to see. Roll me. The flea's gonna have to go. I'm not sure for what yet, but it will have to go. Scorpion. That's a natural one. Ooh, we got a lot of moose triggers here. Love to see it. Okay. Didn't hit the scorpion, unfortunately, but so be it. Alright. How does this do? Hey, we got another win. Maybe this is trending upwards. Probably not, but maybe. The Phoenix Mushroom is looking mighty juicy here. <laughs> Let's say we don't do it though. Okay. I'm tempted to donut on you. And while that might look like a troll play, Promise it's not. We'll donut you for a second though. Good, good. And a chocolate. Thank you. Sabertooth? I don't think it's a sabertooth angle, I'll be honest. Don't need the extra gold. Alright, so <laughs> in one turn, this guy has become. Almost fully maxed out. Health-wise, obviously his attack was over the course of the game. Okay. And then, let's see. don't really like any of these so far. I mean, the dodo could probably head out at any point. Maybe we keep him though, I don't know. Okay, so you're max now. And now we can start getting some some buffs on our little scorpion homie. Oh yeah, we're coming back. <laughs> Watch out. It's happening. The comeback of the century is on our doorstep. Dude, there, we could have had the Phoenix Manticore build. But that's okay. We got other priorities. Those being one, one drops. Tier one pets. Come on, show some love to our scorpion. Scorpions don't get enough love out here. Oh baby. Mike is feeling the wrath over here. Um, I don't think level 3 moose is going to return dividends out here. I'll be straight up with you. Don't need it. Is there any point where you start going peach? Maybe. I wish I could freeze it. I do. I mean, this is fantastic. Hold on. Oh, hold on. We're getting somewhere. Oh, baby. This is going to be the reverse sweep, I'm calling it. <laughs> this is too good. Way too good. Now our Scorp is almost 50 health. Love it. 
<laughs> the green peppers mean nothing. Nice try. Not gonna carry through this time. How is this gonna work? It will not. For him, at least. But he has Excalibur, what? I'm telling you. Look at all these Manticores. We'll have to run it. We'll definitely run that build at some point. The Manticore Phoenix build seems too fun. But now the question is kind of, what do we do at, like, once the moose is done scaling, who do you replace him with? I'm, I'm genuinely not sure. I haven't really thought that far ahead, but we're basically there. Maybe we should. Just another Scorp, maybe? Maybe we could look for a Conpeto. Um, either way... Well, I guess we don't really need to let him run another time. Hold on to you. Scorpion here. Hold these two. This is already a 4-4. Four, four. We haven't even hardly been looking for him yet. Pretty impressive. Well, that's an issue. That's an issue. I'd be running it like this. We go here, and then let's look for a dodo. We did not find a dodo. I think we'd rather run the scorpion like this, right? Alright, let's see how this team does. I don't know how it's gonna do. I don't really. Maybe it'll be fantastic. Probably not, but maybe. You hate to see it. I mean, that's that's basically how you're going to get with the moose, you know? Even with these great moose abilities and stuff, if you get this late in the game, like, let's remember, we, we were on turn 9 or 10 when we got our first win. If our early game was a little better, we would have gotten the 10 wins. But it doesn't stack up well into the ultra late game, because they're all, like, 50-50s. But it's a pretty good one. I like the moose. I, I would recommend it. Seems like a decent team. Not amazing, but not terrible either. Um, it looks like we're gonna be okay. Love not losing the first one. Mm -hmm, let's do it like this. Try to get a big homie hiding in the back here with the ants. Okay, the mosquitoes are on a mission out here. Alright, we gotta level up, see what we get. Cappy early is solid. Go here. Get an ant cooking. Maybe chupacabra, potentially. TBD on that one. I think this is a good setup. I like where we're at here. Okay, that's great. It's going well for us too. Fantastic. So in this case, I think we sell you for the Chupacabra. We can roll a few times. Maybe just throw the ant in. Yeah, I'd like to get some more I think it's too slow holding on to him. Okay, we hit the Frost Wolf. That's great. And I think we combine throwing a Drop Bear. And this is honestly a very strong team for, for the state of the game right now. I'm loving this. Okay. 
Okay, we could pineapple on you. Don't think it's really that that worth it. Uh, I don't mind dodo here though. Maybe run a little dodo. Ditch the drop bear, go for a rat in the front. Okay. I'm liking this team. Can't put my finger on exactly why, but I like it. <laughs> I think it's a good one. All we need now is just to give it a little life, and we're cooking. Roll me. I think this is the situation where we hold on to you until tier four so we can get the five. Um, in which case, could run it a few different ways. I'm thinking maybe Maybe we just roll. Try to get some more duplicates here. See what we can work out. Oh, they nailed our chupacabra out there. Mosquitoes are on a mission. Alright. Give me a level. A moot. Moose pairs very well with Dodo. Maybe that's the way we push it. You've done your job. Thank you, come again. Throw you in. Throw you in. We don't care about the, the moose triggers quite yet. We're still kind of developing here. Okay, good, good. And we're doing it. We're getting there. Now do we care about a rat here? Are we going for like a level two? I can't imagine we are. It works okay with the chupacabra, but the moose kind of takes over for his role anyway. Um, let's roll a couple, see what we can find here. So far, not much. Maybe an old mouse? If we can get an old mouse cooking, that, that could be alright. Not liking any of these too much. Just get some moose triggers, call it a day. I wish we had a croissant on our dodo. That would be fantastic. Okay. So now is where we gotta go pivot. We gotta get a good pivot in here. I like the dodo. It's a good start. Sabertooth with double moose seems fantastic. I think that's reason enough to full send here. To be honest. So hold on to you. Um, let's let's roll. See if we can find some of these homies. So right now we're looking for probably. I want to get a donut on the the saber tooth as soon as possible. Ordering is just atrocious. We freeze both of them. And they get instantly melon. You hate to see it. Okay, roll me. Croissant. I've been talking about getting croissant on you. Hmm. Don't love any of these. Trying to get the other tier one, I guess. That's all we really can do. Alright, so we're getting a ton of health, as is typical with the moose. Okay. Man, if we get the saber tooth to tier 2, 
or level two, we're gonna be cooking. It's gonna be fantastic. But we have not yet. We gotta make sure we focus up. Get that to happen. Mm. We're just rolling again. Not finding nearly as much chocolate as I would like. to save tooth back and forths. Alright. Really focus up here. We need... White Tiger could actually be really solid. White Tiger in front of the Sabertooth as a little interim. It could absorb a lot of moose triggers, admittedly. But it is very, very strong. Let's hold on to you. Let me give you a mushroom. There's a dodo. <laughs> what do we want here? I say we try it. It might not pay out, but it very well could do. Especially with the mushroom, you know? Like, this guy's huge. Yeah, see, that's... The 5-5 five five doesn't quite get it as much as the 10-10 ten ten would. And now it'll be a tier 3. We have Sabertooth again. If we want it. What if we ditch the White Tiger and double stack Sabertooth? <laughs> or just get a Grizzly too? Both valid options. Let me try the Grizzly. Hold on to you. You hold on to you. A little ugly. Alright, we'll get our moose. Who cares about the lasagna? I do a little bit. <laughs> but we don't need to talk about that. Okay, fantastic. They overrode our mushroom. That doesn't seem like it will matter. It will not. Fantastic. We're, we're one win away. Can we get it? Ooh, that's huge. Um, we can't freeze because we already have this guy unless we luckily don't roll into another tier one. Let's assume we will, as we did. I need Lollipop this weekly, that's what we need out here. You know how strong that would be? Actually insane. I think we're good here. There's no way this Phoenix takes everyone out, right? <laughs> that would be insane. There it is. The moose feels really good. As long as you have some sort of attack to combo with it, like a Dodo or a Yellow Jacket or something, the moose scaling feels really strong this week. And then bear, of course, fits well with it too. If you made it this far, odds are you're enjoying the content. And I've got great news for you. There's plenty more where that came from. Check out these videos here that YouTube thinks that you might enjoy. And I will see you all in the next episode. Have a good one.